What's up everyone? It has been a really long while um, and I haven't been playing Kendama as much as I should and recently I started getting back to it and I realized that, you know, I haven't bought a Kendama in about two years. The last one I had was from 2019 um, and I decided, well, let's just order some Damas and see how it looks, or see how it turns out. So, package is waiting for me at home. Um, it's, it's nuts. It's been driving me nuts. The guy called me about a couple of hours ago to say that the package has arrived and you're not at home, you're at the office and you're like, you know, I gotta get back home and get this. So, I'm on my, I'm on my way back home. I'm gonna open up the package and I'm gonna share with you guys what's in it. So I'll see you guys when I get back home. Right, so here it is. I have it in all its glory. Here's what it looks like. It came in from Japan. And it came in at about, um, I think this evening, and I was at the office. And I, <laughs> to be frank with you, I was a little bit like cheesed out because I was not there when I received it. But whatever, let's get to it. Um, disclaimer, I do know what most of the things inside are, but I have never seen them up in person. I've only ever seen them in Instagram or Facebook and stuff like that. So without further ado, let's cut this bitch up. Um, god damn it, where do I even start? Um, so this is a thanks to my good friend who resides in Japan, uh, Tokyo, who helped me get all of these things. And interestingly, keeps it in a Vibram shoe like that. So, opening it up. Oh god damn it. Ah. Fucking don't care. Ah. Here we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Ah, let me reposition myself. Oh hell yeah. Oh. Okay, so um I do know some of these but there is one dama that i did not expect to receive and i'm going to show that one first so <laughs> thank you man this is a soul kandamas mumu coffee dama this is this is awesome this is awesome so this should be the wow this is this looks sick look at that <clears throat> Okay, it's got a bearing. Look, guys, I haven't bought Damas in two years. So the last one I bought was this guy here, right here. This is a reshaped version one, Kiyaki. And this one comes with a um, Spin Gear Sweets collab thing going on. So needless to say, this is, this is a pretty good start. This, I believe, is a sole one-up shape. Chad, if you're watching this, please correct me. Or, well, anyone. Oh, did you hear that? Ooh. Oops, sorry. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that just sounds perfect. Thank you so much for this hookup. I am so excited. Um, what else is in this? Yeah, nothing much. Now, on to the meat. We have the second item, which, oh my god. This guy right here, this is a pretty nondescript bag, but inside you can see. Mm hmm. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a Suleb Friction Clear. Seven or was it sorry eight year anniversary Dhamma So 
how we got to this i'm gonna explain to you in a short bit because that's gonna involve opening up the next item um and i kind of like this actually this is a pretty neat design sulap you're doing pretty good work i haven't been able to visit su for a very long time since i was last in tokyo and i really wish to go there again but you know all this pandemic nonsense I just i just wanted to die quickly oh my god Oh my god, do you hear that? ASMR, people. Oh. God, that sounds good. Alright, I'm not going to waste time with that. And, well, we've got so many things in here. What the heck? Dude's really hooking me up. What is in here? Oh! Oh ho! Oh, oh. Okay, this should this should be enough of an indication what this is. This isn't a round square burglary thing. Poi. I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm I'm very not cultured with burglaries, but thank you, sir. This is pretty awesome. Um but this looks sick. Okay. I am gonna figure this one out. I'm gonna post some videos on this. Dude, hooked me up real good. Okay, next up. Um, I'm gonna save that one for last. You're not gonna see it yet. Okay, so I'm gonna open the second last thing, which is one of the reasons why I got the eighth anniversary Dama in the first place, which is. <laughs> This guy. This is one of Sulab's more recent releases. This is the Ash, and I believe he calls it Jasmine. Oh my god, it feels so good in your hand. Oh, look at that. Okay, that feels really good. That does not compare to Kush Clear at all even at first touch seriously so it's ash and there's a little bit of a silver-ish sparkle sort of thing if you could see it it's kind of similar to the the tama i have here but you know under white light i guess it doesn't do it justice i think under sunlight it will look way better and this this is going to be paired with something I don't know what, but it's going to be paired with something. Maybe even this guy. Oh, hey, what's up? Future Azrin here. And I noticed while editing the video, I did say that I wanted to talk about how I came about getting this 8-year Dama. And I did. So here it is. So what happened is that when this released, the Jasmine and the other one, was it Ariel? I can't quite remember. But... I got both of it. I managed to get both of it. Um, and there was word on the street that there was a homie in Japan who missed out on the drop and he was desperately looking for a red one, which so I had. Um, he asked around and word got to me and he said, well, would you like to trade your red Tama with this setup? To which I said, yes. So, I don't know. I th really think it was a worthy trade. I wouldn't mind. I have one of these already. Um, and getting a pretty limited edition setup is pretty sweet, to be honest. So, deals go down. Here we are today. All right, back to the video. Okay. The last one, which I am really, really excited about. Without further ado, I present to you this box. You should probably know what this is by now. This is the Christian Fraser Legend Mod. I was extremely lucky to get this. I, I just, you know, I was pretty cheesed out when they sold out. 
you know, I heard about it when I got back into Damas, when I got back into playing. And oh lord, it looks good. The boost shape though. Gosh, that feels good. Guys, look. Look, look, look at this. This is amazing. I, I just, you know, ASMR shit, right? Oh. Doesn't that just feel great? I hope you guys are wearing headphones for this. But I can tell you for sure, holding the Kush Clear and the Friction Kill side by side, it does not feel the same at all. Um, Kush Clear feels like... Um, I don't know how to explain it. It's It feels like a really nice finish. Um, a little bit rubbery. But Friction Clear feels a lot more... Hmm, velvety, is that is, if that's even a word. So, it's pretty interesting, actually. So let's see. Same can, sound test. Oh, that's a higher pitch. Sorry, guys, I just can't help it. Oh, this one, a little bit of a lower pitch. I can just do this all day but you know this is what it is so after not buying for two years I have gone ham and I have gotten lucky to the person who has provided me with this thank you so much and also hooked it up with the burglary or poi I'm not really sure what this is yet. And also the Moomoo. I thank you very much. Because this is a perfect opportunity for me to try two. Actually three of the most popular shapes right now. The 1-Up. And then I've got the Boost. And finally I've got the Sulab Absolute Ken. Which needless to say. This purchase alone. This, these cops can last me for a good year or two. I guess that's it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to play with this for a bit. And I guess if you want to know what I think about it. Well, I don't know. DM me. So this is it. There's nothing else in the box. Um, this wraps. Yeah. Right. Peace. See ya.